Get ready for the smackdown Get ready for the smackdown How you gonna react when you're put in the back Cause there's no turning back when you're facing the smackdown Welcome back to Villain Wars, guys. Uh, this is fight number 27. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed the first two fights. Uh, like I said, always show some love and respect to the two requesters of those last two fights. We move on to the next fight here, and we have the likes of Trigon from DC Comics versus Sean McGrath from Marvel Comics. So we have two powerful demons in this. One from DC, the other from Marvel. Very ancient demons as well. So let's kick it off with Trigon. I think, once again, everybody I think knows Trigon, the demon. He is Raven's father. And uh, Trigon is a guy, let's just put it like this. He's a guy that is a demon that you has been around for hundreds of years like he's been around for years um, and this guy is always trying to you know rule you know no matter where he is you know he's always trying to rule and you know, he's dangerous he's, he's very powerful He's the son. He's the he's the, the the father of Raven, making Raven half demonic, and this guy possesses demonic powers at an unmeasurable scale to all other like demo demons. Like, you know, he. I've seen this guy take shots from powerful. Individuals like Superman shake it right off. I mean, he can, he has, I've seen him basically take almost mites from like Dr. Fate, you know? Um, Trigon is very, has very, He's good and he's uh, very knowledgeable in sorcery, um, very powerful, you know, very, very powerful. Um, he also has always been empowered because of when he was born. So he's always been empowered that way. He can cast illusions. He can manipulate your mind. Um, he also carries a mystical staff that is very powerful. Um and Trigon guys is just a character you are not you, you don't want to be screwing with let's just put it like that it's always like when you see this guy it's like oh shit that's the way to look at it so let's move on to his combatant in this and we move on to the Marvel Universe and we're talking about Shoma Goth Goth the big squid like eyeball creature um, he's been around for a thousand a hundred one million years and he he's he's a ruler they call him the ruler of a hundred different dimensions they also call him he who sleeps but shall soon awake um, He's dealt with the likes of Doctor Strange, of course. Um, he, Sean McGraw, even the Ancient One has faced him in the past. Um, he's been around, like I said, he's been around for years. So, you know, he's another one that has seen a lot. And, you know, don't let his look fool you like, oh, you know, look at it. He looks like just a big squid or with a big eye. Blah, blah, blah. Don't let that fool you. This guy is very powerful indeed very powerful very powerful ancient demon with 
vast supernatural powers. Um, he is basically in his native dimension where he comes from, he's virtually unstoppable. So the only way you really can beat him is outside of his dimension. And that's kind of how Doctor Strange and them have been able to beat him. Uh, but almost it's never really unknown that he's dead. Like he always seems to return. Uh, like I said, his powerful magic skills. He's also very gigantic. Like I said, um, like he's really big. He's he's <laughs> he's his strength is really unknown. Like. That's the scary thing. It's like you don't really know how strong he is, just because you're big, you know. Just but he is a he is a very gigantic demon, squid, octopus-like character, and oh boy, you know he's a he's a major threat. So when you put these two titanic demons together in one room, what do you think they're going to be like, okay, we're going to shake hands and no, they're going to fight to claim who's power, who's the more powerful. And I could see these two just going at it. Now, the advantage of each would be fighting in one's own dimension. If Trigon fights in his own world, Trigon may have the advantage. If Gorath is in his own dimension, Gorath has the advantage. But the point is, is wherever these two fight heaven help the inhabitants of it because they're going to be the ones that's going to pay um honestly guys i don't see a clear-cut winner i see the 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 losers being the people wherever they're fighting um that's just the way i look at it but i'll leave it up to you guys i want to hear your opinions what do you feel who is the winner trigon from DC Comics or Shoma Goth Garoth from Marvel and show some love and respect to uh, 58632HHH this was his fight he put these two ancient powerful demons together and uh, I'll be back with the final f official fight for section 21 the 28th fight and I will be right back.